Hello, you're looking at a 1983 Honey Motorhome that is really cool. It's in good shape. It uh, definitely has no odors, no mildews, no leaks that I can see that are current. Um, runs and drives well. And it's going to be a great buy for somebody. Um, looking for a cheap murder home. Looking for a... Uh, what am I thinking of? Um, tailgate bus. That's what I'm thinking of. To, for the football games. Want to go to the races. Want to make up a hunting trail or something like that? That would be this. It uh, only has 79,000 miles on it. And the air conditioning is blowing cold. Let me see what the hood release is. If that hood release is outside or inside. Wait a minute here. It might be outside on this. Let me see. Alright, watch. You can see the air turning. Let's see, it has a 5.7 liter V8. Battery's nice and strong. Yeah, the air's cold. Now, this is how it came in. It's been sitting for maybe six months or so. Though it does have a current Pennsylvania inspection that was only done like three, four hundred miles ago. Now I'm taking it to the detail shop from here, so it's going to be clean as a pin when it when I comes back, and it's clean right now. It just needs a uh, you know a bit of a clean up from being dusty. Nice big picture window on the side. What you look for in these class C's or class um, B's is leakage around the window. Now it does have some caulking around it. Oh, we'll, I'll show you inside. Anyway, one of the things I like about this is a nice big picture window on the side. Hear the motor running. And uh, it's got a great view sitting from the uh, kitchen table. It's got a box that was made on the back for taking bicycles or... or uh, luggage, whatever. Give you a quick look on the roof here. I'm going to kill myself. Roof looks good. All been sealed. It's good to do that every year or so. I'm up in rural Pennsylvania. You can see by the horse over there. This is the area where this um, trailer lived and it was a trade-in on a newer one. The big RV sale this weekend and this was one of the trade-ins. Um, I have found these PA motorhomes and campers to be very nice. They have a yearly inspection. Um, the people in areas like this just tend to take better care of some things. Uh, this guy was definitely handy. He built a little box on top of the stove. They built the box in the back, built a bike rack on the front, did some custom stuff like put a floor in it. Um, but it's very usable just like it is. Now you can see in the corner there is a little bit of tape. So probably at some point there was a leak there. But no leak now. It's rained a lot lately. No leak now. And uh, very clean this um this mattress no problems underneath of it so has a fold down sofa a fold down table here for shorter people or kids and a sleeping area up there which I'm sure is the most comfortable place it has heat and air conditioning here, which works. Where's the uh, where's the switch? Well, it has air conditioning anyway. Stainless steel sink. 
Nice little roll ups here for storage. A nice compact little John and vanity and a tub with a sink. And this thing just works fine. Nice big storage hanging locker here. Everything works in this trailer. Somebody spent some time playing with it. The uh, refrigerator looks older, but uh, the gentleman told us that it worked fine. Now take that as a grain of salt. He told us that it worked fine. We're not able to try it, but uh, we were told that it works fine. And looking at everything else in here, including the air conditioning, uh, I would believe him. Here are some of the books. Earner's manuals. So, that's the story. It's being sold with a very low reserve. It'll be a great deal for somebody. Find one in this shape selling for the price that this is going to sell for is a uh, going to be a deal for somebody. All six tires are in nice shape. A couple goats over there and a horse. <laughs> and again, it passed. Got a current Pennsylvania inspection good till next August. And it was only done Seventy-eight five thirty, seventy-nine oh sixty-nine. So it was only done oh, about four hundred some miles ago, and it drove about sixty miles to get to us. So um, it'll drive you home wherever you need to go. Let's go for a quick ride here. Please do not bid unless you're able to finish the transaction. You'll need $250 due at the end of the auction, and then the balance is due within seven days. Now that you don't have to pick it up for 30 days, <coughs> excuse me, but the balance is due within seven days. this hill fine. I'm only giving it a little bit of gas. Plenty of power. And the air is on blowing cold. That ah, got a school bus up here. here and I'll come back down but she rode on the highway 60 miles an hour or so no problem there's a spot right up here got simple system the simple 
5.7 motor with the uh, three speed transmission. Okay. Gears. It drives nice, nice and tight on the road. You can tell all the tires are good because it doesn't wobble around. And it's nice to know that it was inspected also. Seventy nine thousand miles is nothing for this drivetrain. spot down here I can go a little faster and when you come to pick it up you get a bill of sale a, a clean title clear title also and uh, a temporary license tag good for 60 days you can drive it home on that tag and drive it around a little bit if you want to tour in it before you end up titling it there's 55 right there, going uphill. So if you're looking for a cheap murder home, it's got a lot of life left in it. It's been tinkered with and a lot of stuff fixed. Or you're looking for a party bus, the tailgate in. Or are you just looking for a you know a cheap uh, driver? Buy this motor home, you'll have a lot of fun with it. My kids love it, and it'll be a reasonable price for what you're going to get out of it.